Well, hello everybody, my Facebook friends. Happy Thanksgiving. Uh, it is 10.30. Started uh, going to fry a turkey today. A little old 12 pounder, about 13 pound turkey. I got my uh, mother-in-law, my uncle, my girl's uncle, and my girl and me, just four of us today. Well, we're going to be cooking today. We're going to fry a turkey. I got it going right now. Uh, temperature is at uh, not quite 150 and uh, barbecuing some backstrap off a deer we uh, way I like to do it is I usually bleed my meat in cold water for a couple of days a lot of people like to use milk a lot of people use vinegar mom uses vinegar I use just plain old cold water and it bleeds that meat that coldness draws that blood out of that meat and virtually bleeds it out completely. So, uh, put a little backstrap here. What I like to do is I cut it up in chunks and I'll wrap it in bacon. And that kind of gives it, you don't really have to salt it or anything. That bacon will give that meat that bacon flavor. And it, it comes out pretty damn good. I got this idea from a Oh, gentleman, his name was Whitey. He's passed away since, but uh, that was a little trick that he would do. And I tasted some backstrap that he made, and it came out just delicious. So anything, then we got cherry pie, green bean casserole. I think Mom made some kind of another casserole, and uh, but uh, it's probably about close to 60 degrees. It's a little windy today. And uh, we're going to get this party started. Turkey, uh, one thing you people that are going to fry turkey, one thing you want to remember is uh, let it thaw out really good. Pat dry it. Do all your seasonings. Or if you're going to inject it with any seasonings, do that at least a day before. And then uh, what I did was uh, I did mine a day before, well, a couple of days actually. And then this morning I got it out of the refrigerator and I let it set for a few hours and then I pat dried it again and uh, she's ready to go. But it's uh, anywhere from three, three and a half or four minutes per pound. So I got a turkey here and exactly it's exactly weighs 12.56 pounds and we're going to fry it at three minutes a pound so it comes out to 37 minutes so I just rounded off to 38 and it should come out pretty good this is probably going to be about my fifth or sixth turkey to fry and they've all come out pretty good the key the key thing when you're frying a turkey is the time you don't want to undercook it and you don't want to overcook it you want to try to cook it right where it needs to be or you're going to have a, a messed up turkey but anyway I will try to get this on Facebook today. Of course, I'm taking a day off of hunting. I went hunting yesterday. I seen it. I walked up on a doe, and that was about it. Maybe tomorrow. I got Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, so maybe uh, them three days I'll go and uh, do a little hunting. But uh, I want to wish everybody happy Thanksgiving, and you're in our prayers, and happy hunting.